This week on the Digitally Obsessed, I'm teaching how to create this watercolor painting right here. For this DIY, you will need some paper to draw on, a Crayola crayon of your choice, and some watercolors. An option is to have a frame so that you can hang this or put it somewhere. I just put my paper on a clipboard so that I would have a nice flat space. The first thing you're going to want to do is find something to quote. I found this really cute quote on Pinterest that I really liked. First thing I'm going to do is take out the frame of this picture so that I can see how much space I have to work with. So I'm just going to get this card and line it up with some corners. Then I'm going to draw around it so that I can keep my design within the parameters. So now that I've got that all drawn out, I'm going to use this white crayon to write my quote within the box so that when I paint over it, you can still see the white words. Now that this is all drawn out, I'm going to choose the colors I want to paint with. I'm thinking of doing a blue and purple ombre effect. I have this cup of water so that when I paint, I can change color and it won't be a big deal. Remember that the less water you use, the darker the color of the paint will be, and the more water you will use, the lighter the color of the paint will be. Once you're done with your painting, you can just let it dry. Okay, so it says dried and I went over the white crayon with Sharpie to define it even more. Of course, if you do want to leave it white, you can, but beforehand you need to press hard on the white crayon as you're drawing. If not, then you might have to go over it like I did. Now you just want to cut it out to whatever shape you want so it can fit into your frame. I have my frame here and I'm going to just stick that in. Then when you flip it over, you have a nice picture. <laughs> 